we go guys another random video my mate invited me out at four o'clock in the morning to go fishing for some wrasse never had a wrasse before so i thought oh, go out for it so i thought i'd do an introduction because again i was fishing with my friend i don't want to be doing youtube channels with my friends if that makes sense um purely because you know they invited me out fishing to go with me not just at me doing a youtube channel but anyway I got, he said to me, oh, look, we, we basically split up for a little bit. So I thought, oh, I'll quick do a bit of video. He said, well, you can carry on, mate. So um, we had a couple together and then I shot off on my own a little bit, split off. Earthworm Jim came out, didn't he? Yeah, he got us a couple of rats with the Earthworm Jim. Um, but I'm actually going to go through a little bit different than I normally do. I'm just going to go through what I used um, on the actual video because um, obviously, like I said, I was with my mates. I didn't really get to explain too much. You just see a lot of action um, basically on the video. But this is what I was using from two different size hooks. That's from a size 14, so I was using a carp hook size 10. And I was just using a little worm. A live worm was much better, that died. <laughs> they all died, I had none left. So I had to use these. And uh, these are little fake worms. There's the camera, there's the camera. Uh, these are little fake worms you buy off eBay, or wherever you buy them. Just a little rubber worm. And uh, this is basically how we set it up. So we had a brass weight, bringing it down to a swivel and a bead. 20 pound wire trace and this was what I was using all day I didn't snap up once okay and uh, I was using uh, you might have actually thought it was a light rod but if you actually see it just if you see the action in this rod it's actually really stiff you see when I was playing those fish the rod was in half right so it shows how powerful these fish were this is the Daiwa stalking rod it's a stiff carp rod stalking rod so you can see the difference you see what I mean this rod was really, really, really hooped over. Look, look how much pressure I'm putting on it to give it hooped over. So you need a stiff rod, not too light, because they're going to plough into all the lilies and God knows what else. And, uh, yeah, it was a basically really good session. Best session I've had. Well, I've never had a rasp session, so it's PBs for me. Um, sorry about the weird contrast, just because where I got to do the camera today. Um, but, yeah, I'm really happy with the way it turned out. It's a really good little session. So uh, like and subscribe to my channel. And uh, fighting fisherman number nine on Instagram. Wait, enjoy the video. My friend basically on Jack Hunters on YouTube. He's the one that took me today, showed me how to do everything. Um, he's a really good angler. He's taught me a lot. He's a friend from years ago. Um, but he's got his own YouTube channel called Jack Hunters. Um, so check it out if you want to. Right then, guys. Here I am. Huh? I'm talking to the camera. On the tripod, mate. Yeah. Right here I am, ras fishing. Try and catch a ras. I've had two. Last one on the earthworm gym. Here we go. First ras on an earthworm. I'm trying to show you, but honestly, here we go. On earthworm gym. I did thought I recorded the fight, but I didn't. <laughs> right, right now, you sexy laugh. Limpet and worms. Running lead.
savage baits the old limpet and a carp hook Look at that, I thought I didn't have one record. Right, here we go, guys. Making ass as always, that's full of four ass now. I hope I can get this on camera. I said I'm with my friend, so it's not crazy, it's just not good. Look at Look at that, that's a stunner. Really happy with that one. Oh, must have missed about five or six. Scrapped so hard, didn't it? Uh, he was snagged then at some point. I don't know what happened. Right, stop that. Right, guys, typical, isn't it? Camera messed around. I had to stop it because it blew at me. But, oh, I need you out. Right. Boost just had in. It's a screaming take, literally, as I pressed stop. I couldn't help it guys, sorry, it's the wind, it blows the tripod over and I broke the tripod's leg but I gotta go for that all these little gullies it's where the rats hide the rats hide right in there yeah, beautiful day, camp mate got a few rats now 
Um, one of my best videos, but you know, I said I'm out on my friend. Still have a good laugh, you know. He's just gone ahead of me now to try and get some better bass before I get there. He knows I'm going to catch him. <laughs> right, anyway, ciao for now, guys. Really enjoyed the day. It's beautiful. Hopefully, I'll catch